1.21.5 Cyrus minimap for Minecraft is out and super easy to install. Let me go ahead and teach you how to install this minimap mod. Let's go ahead and get started. Now, the first step to install Cytos 1.21.5 is to click the second link in the description, which is gonna bring you over here, a written guide on how to download and install Cytos Minimap. This is here for those of you that prefer to read or look at in-depth detailed guides. If you wanna make this quick though, however, just scroll down to step one and then click the Cytos Minimap button. That is going to redirect you over here where we're going to scroll down and we're going to filter by 1.21.5 where it says all game versions. That is going to give us two different titles. As of right now, later we might have more in here, but pretty much we're looking for the Forge version. Now, if you guys are running any other mod loader like NeoForge, just go ahead and download the NeoForge version. But I'm assuming most of you watching this video might not even have a mod loader. So that's why we're going to download the Forge version. Like I said, select 1.21.5 and then look for Forge. Click on these three dots in here and click download file and wait for Cytos to download. Now, while Cytos downloads, if you want to use a minimap in your own server, click on the first link in the description and get 40% off with Apex Hosting. Now, that is a limited time deal just because of the Minecraft movie. Later on, it's going to go back down to 25% off, which is a still a great deal. But if I were you, I would take advantage of that 40% off right now they have support for over 200 mod packs that you could install with just the click of a button and also they have servers all around the world so you don't have to worry about lagging they support forge fabric or any other mod loader that you could think of and you know by creating your server with apex hosting you'll also be supporting this channel with that first link in the description and now let's keep going with the tutorial and there we go just after five seconds we got the cytos minimap file downloaded let's go ahead and drag and drop it into our desktop once you have the mod in your desktop if you already have the forge mod loader installed just go ahead and add this mod into your mods folder and I'm assuming most of you don't have Forge installed, and that is what I'm going to teach you next. Click on the third link in the description, which is our guide to install Forge. Now, I always do these guides because I know you guys will have a lot of questions, and it's always good for you to go back to the guides and read through it. But if you want to make it quick, scroll down to step one, click on Forge. That is going to bring you over here. Select 1.21.5. And by the way, we also have videos on the channel on how to install Forge 1.21.5. But once you're over here, click on Installer. That'll bring you right here where you're not going to click anything. You're only going to wait five seconds. And only after five seconds have passed, we're going to go ahead and see a button on the top right that says skip, which we're going to click. And then the download for the Forge installer will begin. As you can see right here, we're going to go ahead and drag and drop that file into our desktop, just like we did earlier with the Cyrus minimap file. You could always find that file here on the recent download history or within your downloads folder in your PC. Now that we have these two files, we are ready to begin. The first thing that you want to make sure of is that you have played regular Minecraft 1.21.5 at least once on your computer. All you have to do is open the game and then close it. And then go ahead and close your Minecraft launcher as well and just double click on the Forge installer. Now, once you double click on the Forge installer, you'll get this menu here, select install client, and then hit OK. By the way, if you didn't get the Forge installer to open when you double click on it, don't worry, I'm gonna teach you how to fix it. But once you have it in here, just go ahead and hit OK and wait for Forge to install, which is actually super quick. But if you didn't have Forge open, and even if you did, you still have to see this because it's pretty important. You need Java 21, not only for the Forge installer to open, but for the Cyrus minimap mod to work. Now, I'm assuming by now most of you have Java 21 installed because you've been modding Minecraft for a while. But if you haven't, go ahead and click on the link in the description that says Java 21. Read through the guide. It's actually really simple. You just download the file and then hit next a couple of times and you have Java 21 installed, which is not optional. It's a requirement for any Minecraft above Minecraft 1.20.5. When installing mod, you will need Java 21, at least on your computer. Now, once you install Java 21, you shouldn't have any issues opening Forge or running any mods on Minecraft. Now, let's go ahead and hit OK in here. And now we have Forge installed. So that means that we could get rid of the installer file from our desktop. Just go ahead and delete it and just skip your Cyrus minimap. Now, to add this mod into Minecraft, it's super easy. Let's go ahead and open our Minecraft launcher. And if we install Forge properly, we should see selected here automatically, as you can see down here. And now we're going to add the mod. And to do so, head over to installations. Make sure that you have modded selected because without modded, you actually won't see Forge in here. And if you still don't see Forge, by the way, just click on new installation and then look for Forge in here. You could just type it and then select Forge 1.21.5, name it whatever you want, and then click install on the bottom right. But once you have Forge in here, hover over that Forge line and click on the open installations folder button right here. That is going to open a folder that contains a lot of files, but we are specifically looking for another folder called mod. As you can see, I have my mods folder right here, but I'm actually going to delete it. And the reason I deleted it is to teach you what to do if you don't have a mods folder. If you don't have a mods folder, you could click on new, click on folder, and then just name it mods, M-O-D-S. Yes, you could create the mod folder yourself. Now go ahead and open the mod folder. And in here, we're going to go ahead and drag and drop that Cyrus minimap file that we downloaded in the first step of this guide. That should be one of the only mods that you should have in here. 
and if you have any other mod, just make sure they are forged and that they are 1.21.5 as well to prevent any issues. Now go ahead and close this folder out, go back into your Minecraft launcher and then click play right next to forge. You might get a prompt if this is the first time you're playing forge, just go ahead and read through that prompt and then hit understand and then hit play and you have forge open. Once forge opens, we know that we're in forge because it says it everywhere, like on the top left and on the bottom left. Let's go ahead and test out our minimap. We could see also the mod spawn in here and we could see that Cyrus is right there, but I want to launch a world and see my minimap in action. Again, I'm going to launch a single player world, but if you need a multiplayer server, just go ahead and use that first link in the description to get a server with Apex Hosting at a discount. And as you can see, once we're inside the game, we can see Cyrus working on the top left without any issues. You could also press the letter Y on your keyboard and you will get the settings for Cyrus in here. You could change the position, you could change the shape, you could do a bunch of things with Cyrus actually, which is pretty cool. You could also press U to access the waypoint system for Cyrus, but that is pretty much how to download and install Cyrus minimap for Minecraft 1.21.5. If this video helped you, don't forget to subscribe and as always, bye bye.